Good morning students. Uh, the next practical which you are going to learn is study of population density and frequency by different plant population by quadrat method. Okay. So, you can see here uh, the setup which is there. Now, firstly as the name says population density and frequency. Density and frequency is a physical term which we more often use in physics. Then why you are using over here? Now, with the help of density and frequency we can come to know the population of a particular plant species by quadrat method when you say quadrat method it is come mathematics right quadrilateral so we are using quadrats to identify the total number of population in a particular plant species right now density means what mass upon uh, volume or area etc whereas frequency the number of uh, oscillation vibration which takes place but here why we are using density frequency to identify the particular plant species the more number of time occurrence or the density number of species present etc right so what we are doing is we are taking a setup now uh, why it is required or where it can be applied now if you take an agricultural field farming area or even a forest area there may be different plant species we cannot go and manually count these numbers so how the census is taken what you take is you take a small area find out the number of species which of species are present those species you identify and then calculate the, those number with the total area which is present thereby you can come to know an exact number or approximate number of species present in that given area that is agriculture area farming area or a forest area that is why this method will be useful so two ways are there one is we can use the artificial way by using a tray the soil sample and different species or else you can take a picture of the sample in that different species will be there you can do the counting so i use a method where i am taking a tray uh, you can tie a thread or use a rubber band to make six quadrants and then put the uh, spread out the samples now how we can calculate the density frequency it's very easy firstly what you have to do is you have to count the samples now you have taken five samples example you can see the moon mudki Kala Vatana, Kabuli Chana and the normal Chana, 5 species are taken which is spread out. For example, you take the uh, moon, count the species, it may be for example here uh, 5 number, here it may be 3 in number, here it may be 2 in number, here again 6 in number, here 4 in number. So the, if you take the total count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 quadrant, it is coming to 5 plus 3, 8, 10, 16, 20. So 20 species in all of uh, moon and divide by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 quadrants. There are 6, we are taking only 5. So, 20 divided by 5, we get the density. That is 20 divided by is 4. So, the density of this population of moon is 4. Now, what is the frequency? Into 100. So, we get uh, into 100 is 400. The frequency is 400. So, 400 times uh, in the entire area, we can find this particular species. So, we can, in that way, we can find the individual species whichever is present. Uh, by counting the numbers uh, upon the total quadrant we get the density and the same number into 100 we get the frequency once again i'll give an, uh, another example suppose uh, i take the example of uh, moong again or matki again if you count it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 here it is again 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 here it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 so 10 8 12 and then here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so again uh, uh, it is become uh, 10 18 uh, 30 40 and uh, here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 here also it is 10 so it is coming to 50 if you take approximate number 50 50 divided by 1 2 3 4 5 5 quadrant so it is 50 divided by 5 it is 5 tens are 50 so it is density is 10 for the particular species that is matki and if you take the frequency it will be 50 upon 5 into 100 so we get uh, 10 into 100 1000 so its frequency is 1000 so we get 1000 times this particular species in this given area. So, if you count a particular given area uh, and then multiply into the total area, you can find the number of species present in the entire agricultural field or a farming area or a forest area. So, this particular experiment helps to identify the species by uh, finding out the density and frequency by the quadrant method. Clear all of you? Thank you.